Hello and welcome back. In our previous video, we customized the controlling area and had our company code assigned to it. In this video, we are going to customize the plant. This is one of the most important units in maintenance related structure. Our customizing path starts from SPRO. Then we go to IMG, then to Enterprise Structure, Definition, then to Logistics, and then we are going to define our plant here. So we click on it and we get a pop-up window. It has three activities. We are interested in defining our plant, so we click on the first one and that gets us to a list of plants that have already been defined. So in our case we're going to create a new entry. We are creating a new plant. So we click on new entries and then we can give a name or a code to our plant. We're going to call it BRI3. And then it's going to be Bridges IQ Oceanside. We can repeat the name there. And we are now ready to go ahead and save. So when we do that, we get a screen here where we are supposed to enter our address information. And for the sake of uh, this presentation, I'm not going to populate most of these fields here. I'm only going to populate the country field. The reason being it's a mandatory field. You can see the check mark here. So I'm going to enter US and then enter. So I'm prompted to save the customizing request. So I go ahead and do that. And now our plant has been created. So the next thing that we are going to do is to assign this plant that we have just created to the company that we created earlier. So I'm going to go back to I'll go back to Enterprise Structure and then instead of selecting Definition I'm going to select Assignment then Logistics then Assign Plant to Company Code so I click on that and then I have a list of of plants that have already been assigned company codes. So for example you see the first plant which is 0002 has been assigned company code 0001. So we are going to create our new entry because this is what we want to do. We want to assign our plant to a company code. So I'll hit on new entries. Then I know I can remember my company code was BRIQ. So I'll go down and look for it. So I have it here. I click on it. I select it. And then I can enter my plant. This is what we have just created a few minutes ago. So that was BRI. Three. That was BRI three. So now I'll go ahead and save. And now my plant has been assigned to the company code. So that is how you assign your company code or your plant to a company code. So in the next video we shall 
look deeper into the plant from a maintenance perspective. We're going to be looking at the planting plant, the maintenance plant, and how all that ties into the plant or the structure that we have been creating so far. So thank you for watching and see you in the next video.